How do you turn off GIFs, memes, and emojis in Microsoft Teams? Here's how. Hi, I'm Mark Dixon, and welcome back to another Tuesday Tech Tip. If this is your first time here, or if you haven't done so already, hit the subscribe button and the notifications bell. I release a Tuesday Tech Tip for teachers every week. So we've got our students back and we're delivering sessions online via Microsoft Teams. And every now and again, we've got some students using GIFs and emojis and memes a little bit inappropriately, and we want to turn them off. Well, here's how you do it. It's really simple. Okay, to get started, you go over to your team site and then where your team's name is, you click the ellipsis and you go to manage team. Then you go over to the settings tab and then scroll down to fun stuff. And this is where you can turn off GIFs, stickers and memes. So at the moment we've got ours enabled. We're gonna take that one off. We're gonna take the stickers and memes off. And now the students will not be able to post GIFs or stickers or memes. Now there are other options you can do. You can turn them back on again and you can change the level of filter. Now ours is set to strict through our organization. But also with the stickers and memes, you can allow people to upload or not their own customized memes as well. Now you need to be careful because things need to be appropriate for an education setting. So it might be worth turning them off. It depends on your class and what you want to do with them. You can also go over to your general tab and then click the ellipsis there and go to manage channel. And here you can decide whether you want to turn the chat on or off as well. So if you change it from anyone can post messages to only owners can post messages, that means that once you finish teaching, you set it to this, and that means that the students cannot carry on chatting in your class. Um, so some people might find that useful. At the moment, I've got mine set to anyone can post messages so that I want my students to carry on talking, even if I'm not there. But for some other people, it's not appropriate for them and they need to turn it off. And that's where you do it. You turn it off in the channel. So there you go. That's how easy it is to turn off your GIFs, memes and emojis in Microsoft Teams. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button if you haven't done so already. And I'll see you again for another Tuesday Tech Tip.